to this thing called the internet, and we searched for Hainan and ecotourism, and up came this organization, Sea Turtles 911. We started doing a little bit of research on it, and we talked about, you know, we, we knew we had only three or four days. Were we just going to pick up and go sit in a resort somewhere for a few days, or were we going to go try to... Do something a little more meaningful. And, and sit in a resort for three or four days. <laughs> Uh, and Sea Turtles, the organization brought, brought those two things together. So we spent time scrubbing and cleaning and feeding the turtles, and then scrubbing and cleaning and feeding ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> well, we went to the village, to the turtle hospital, and that was, was quite interesting to, to be in a very local setting take the boat out to the floating hospital. It really is floating out on water. So you get to, you, you come in on the boat, you, you float into the floating hospital, you assess turtles, make sure everyone's doing okay. There's a range of animals, some of them been there for a while, probably closer to a release date, others who have various injuries. So, so we took one of the larger residents out who, who had a lot of algae, a lot of green things growing on his back, out of the water and put him put him onto the platform and scrubbed him with little scrub brushes. What was his name? William Blake. Bill. 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 His friend's car. Milkshake. That's Yum. Right. They're very good. <laughs> it's very beautiful in the resort. Our room is, is huge with our own private um, hot spring water bathtubs in room, and then also the, the hot springs out here that we can use with with um, various interesting you know, red wine or rose petal scented or what were some of the others? Ginseng hot springs, all to cure a different. Um, Ginseng is good, we're not convinced by the milk. And other spa treatments are available. So you can also pamper yourselves while you're here. That's right, you pamper the turtles, turtles in the morning in the and yourself in the afternoon. <laughs> There's a number of things to do uh, in the area. The hot springs here, the pool, uh, the resort that's right next to the uh, where you stay. Uh, we spent an afternoon at a rainforest center, about a half hour drive away, some time down at Sanya on the beach. And what would they be doing when the, when the kids come down to work with the turtles? Well, for a lot of it, they would be feeding the turtles and learning. Learning about turtles. Did you like learning about the turtles? Mm -hmm. I learned a lot. Yeah. Well, I liked that I could uh, learn about the sea turtles and that I could help them. And it was, uh, it was the first time I've actually been so close to them. Well, you cannot try to catch them on fishing lines and things like that. The jewelry is a danger for the sea turtles. Yeah, plastic also. You know, any organization like this, there have the people who are running the organization, no matter how small or how large, if they don't have an innate passion for what they're doing, it doesn't happen. You know, that passion is very, very obvious. Right, right. You leave, you leave with in your head, trying to make lists of what you can do. What can do we do after we after leave? You leave. Yeah. Highly suggest anyone who has at least three or four days to come out to Hainan Island and devote some time to Sea Turtles 911, both the organization and the turtles, and find out what you can do to help them and bring them back. Sea Turtles 911. <laughs>